Okay, explanation function, question B. Okay, uh, question B. Um, okay, question B. Uh, f x equals to the two or raised to the power of uh, one minus x. Okay, first step here, you find the horizontal asymptote of the exponential function. Uh, y here equal to the zero. Yeah, horizontal asymptote. Uh, so here you label the horizontal uh, y here equal to zero, yeah. And step two, find the y-intercepts of the exponential function x here equal to zero, and you find the value of y uh, f zero here equals uh, two, and uh, y-intercepts at the uh, zero two. So you labels uh, the intersection at the zero two here, okay. And uh, step three, uh, you check the uh, shape of the exponential function. Okay, uh, step three, you check the shape of the uh, exponential function. Uh, here, uh, two, raised to the, uh, two raised to the power of uh, one minus x. Okay, you check the power here uh, equals to the negative x, yeah? And uh, shape, uh, you reflect on the uh, y axis, the shape of the exponential function, yeah? And uh, last, you draw the uh, exponential function. Okay, yeah. Uh, you draw the exponential function y in the step here at the zero two and the horizontal asymptote at the y equal to zero. Okay, so you labels uh, fx here equals to the uh, two raised to the power of uh, one minus x, yeah. Okay, from the graph of the exponential function, you check the domain of the function, uh, negative uh, infinity to the positive infinity, all the real numbers, and the uh, range of the exponential function here, uh, zero to the positive uh, infinity, yeah? Uh, Jawapan solution saya lepas tu, you buat correction, eh? uh, yang ini yang betul, yeah? Uh, dia punya... Uh, horizontal tu bukan equals to 1. Horizontal symptoms here equals to the uh, 0. Itu buat pembetulan. Yeah. Okay, and the uh, second uh, graph of the fx equals to the uh, e uh, to the x, x plus b. And the uh, constant e here greater than uh, 0. Yeah. Uh, e here equals to the 2, 5, uh, 7, 1, 5. Okay, first you check the uh, horizontal asymptote of the function. Uh, horizontal equal to the zero. And the intercepts of the function, uh, y intercept here exists at the uh, zero one. Okay, check. Uh. Uh, step uh, first uh, uh, graph when a here greater than uh, zero. 
Okay, second, uh, when the value of A here, uh, less than uh, zero. Okay, so you just reflect this graph, reflects on the uh, Y axis, yeah? Okay, uh, this value, you check the value, negative 2, 7.4, uh, you substitute here. Okay, you plot all the point, negative 1, uh, 0, and 1, uh, 0, 0.4. Okay, you check. Uh, you check the uh, value of A, uh, less than 1, uh, greater than uh, 0. Uh, for example, value of A here equals to the 1 over 2, yeah? Okay, uh, A here equals to the 1 over 2 or equals to the 1 over 4, okay? And here is a shape of the exponential function. And uh, when the A here uh, less than uh, 0, A here may be equals to the negative 1. Uh, Fx equals to the E uh, raised to the power of a negative x, okay? And your shape of the exponential function, uh, you reflect on the y axis, yeah? Okay, question 23, sketch the graph of the exponential function and find the domain and find the range of the function. Uh, question A, fx here equals to the e to the x power minus 2. And question B, uh, e to the x uh, plus 2. Okay, first step, uh, before you sketch the graph of the exponential function, uh, function here fx equals to the e to the x uh, minus 2. Uh, first, you find the horizontal asymptote of the exponential function. Uh, so, exponential uh, horizontal here equals to the uh, negative uh, 2, yeah? Uh, negative 2, and then uh, you find the uh, y-intercepts of the function. Uh, y here equals uh, x here equal to 0, and you find the value of y. Uh, so f0 here equals to the uh, negative uh, 1, okay? Uh, so you uh, labels the horizontal asymptote at the y equals to the negative 2, maybe uh, here. Okay, so you label the uh, horizontal asymptote y here equals to the negative 2, and then uh, y intercepts all the function here at the negative 1. Okay, you label, yeah? And then uh, step 3, uh, you check the uh, shape of the exponential function. Uh, so e here, uh, video of uh, e here equals to the 1, and the shape of the exponential function positive. Okay, and you draw the exponential function. Okay, I start from the negative infinity. Okay, start from the infinity. You draw. 
Okay, yeah. And here, uh, graphs of the uh, e to the x power and uh, minus two, yeah. And from the graphs of the exponential function, uh, you just list down the domain of the function. Domain here, all the real numbers, uh, negative to the positive infinity. And the uh, range of the exponential function uh, start at the uh, horizontal asymptote, uh, negative two uh, to the positive uh, infinity. Yeah, very simple. Uh, step one, uh, you find the horizontal asymptote, okay. Uh, step two, you find the y-intercept of the function, negative one. And then last, you sketch the graph of the exponential. Okay, settle. Question A. Okay, you can check the answer here. Okay. And then uh, question, uh, question B. Okay, uh, question B, uh, fx here equals to the uh, e to the x uh, plus 2. Uh, first, you find the horizontal asymptote of the uh, exponential function. Uh, horizontal asymptote equals to the positive 2, yeah? And here, the horizontal asymptote, uh, you draw the dot line at the y equals to the negative 2, yeah? Uh, you draw here. Okay, step two, you find the uh, y intercept of the function. Uh, x here equal to zero, so find the value of y. Uh, f zero here equals to the three. So y intercept here exists at the zero three. So you put the uh, dot at the zero three. And then uh, step three here, you check the shape of the uh, exponential function. Yeah, uh, shape of the exponential function. Uh, here, uh, when a here is uh, greater than uh, zero. Yeah, and then you sketch the graph of the exponential function. Okay, settle. So you check answer. Uh, here you label the y axis. And here you label the x axis of the function. And here y here equals uh, 2. Yeah. And uh, from the graphs of the function here, you find the uh, domain. Uh, domain of the exponential function is uh, all the real numbers uh, negative to the positive infinity. And the uh, range of the function here start at the 2 uh, to the positive uh, infinity. Okay, settle. Okay, 8.5, uh, loss function. Okay, loss function, uh, the general form of the loss function, uh, fx here equals to the loss x base a. Okay, and uh, you check the shape of the uh, log function here. Uh, x intercepts of the function uh, equals to the one. Okay, action deceptive here at the one zero, and here the vertical asymptote of the uh, log function x here equals to the uh, zero. Yeah. Okay, first when the base of the function a here greater than one. Okay, uh, examples of uh, function f x here equals to the uh, log x uh, base 2, okay? Uh, base 2 positive, uh, greater than 1. 
and the shape of the function. You check the shape of the function and you check the intercepts at the one zero and you check the uh, vertical asymptote of the function. Yeah. And uh, this function does not exist for the negative uh, value of uh, x. Okay, second, you check the value of a here, uh, less than 1 and greater than 0. Okay, so um, uh, fx equals to the logs x best uh, 1 over 4, yeah, and uh, shape of the logs function uh, you reflex on the x axis, yeah, data uh, balik kan saja, and here the vertical asymptote here equal to the 0, and the x intercept here at the uh, 1, 0, yeah, uh, domain of the exponential function, uh, 0 to the positive infinity, and the range of the exponential here, all the real numbers, negative infinity to the positive uh, infinity. Okay, here you compare the uh, shape of the logs function. Uh, when a here greater than 0 first, and uh, second, when the best here less than 1 and uh, greater than 0. Uh, you just reflect on the x axis. Okay. And the relationship between the exponential function and the logs function. Okay. Uh, fx here equals to the a to the x power. Here the exponential function. Okay, a to the x power. And uh, between exponential and the log function, you put the dot line. Y here equals to the x. And here the inverse function uh, equals to the log x uh, base 2. Okay, question 24, you sketch the graphs and find the domain and find the range of the function. Uh, question A, fx here equals to the logs x minus 1, best 2. Okay, before you sketch the graph of the exponential function, you find the um, uh, vertical asymptote of the function. Okay, uh, first you find the vertical asymptote of the uh, log function. Uh, function here fx equals to the log x minus 1 base 2. Uh, you let the function x minus 1 uh, equal to the 0. And the vertical asymptote here exists at the x equals to the 1. Okay, okay you draw the dot line here at the x equals to the 1. 
Okay, here is uh, the uh, vertical symptom of the log function. Okay, and then uh, step two, uh, you find the uh, x-intercepts of the uh, loss function. So x-intercepts here uh, at the y equal to zero and the value of x here equals uh, two, yeah? x-intercepts here. Here is the value of the x-intercepts of the function. Okay, you put the dot here at the x equals two. And then the uh, shape of the uh, log function uh, here. Okay. And here, base here equals 2 and uh, power of uh, x minus 1. Okay. And then uh, you draw the uh, graph of the log function. Okay. Settle. Huh? You check. Uh, so the intercepts here at the 2 and um, uh, vertical symptom here at the x equals to 1. Okay, so you label the vertical symptom 1 and here y as is and here x as is of the loss function. Yeah, and uh, from the graphs here, uh, you find the domain, find the range of the function. Uh, domain of the exponential function here start at the uh, 1 to the positive uh, infinity. Yeah. And the range of the function, uh, all the ray numbers, negative to the positive uh, infinity. Okay, settle. Yeah. And you check the intercepts of the log function. Intercept of the log function, uh, tempat dia sebelum the uh, vertical asymptot. Okay. Uh, your vertical asymptot here equals to 1. Jadi tempat dia di sebelah. Maksud dia tempat dia x equals to uh, kalau you punya vertical symptom here equals to 3, uh, so intercept here equals to the 4. Tempat dia sebelah sahaja. Ya, yeah? mudah. Huh? Okay. Okay, and then uh, question uh, B. Okay, um, uh, question uh, B, fx here equals to the uh, logs x plus 2, uh, base 2. Uh, first here you find the uh, vertical asymptote of the function. Uh, yeah? uh, vertical asymptote, you let the x plus 2 here equal to the 0. Uh, so x here equals to the negative 2. Yeah? Uh, you put your vertical asymptote here. Uh, you put the dot line at the x equals uh, negative 2. So here you label the vertical symptom of the function. And second, the intercept of the function uh, uh, at the negative uh, 1, 0. Ya, tempat dia sebelah sahaja. Okay. And then uh, you check the shape of the function. Uh, shape of the function uh, here uh, when a here equals uh, 2. Okay, and last you draw the graph of the log function. Okay, settle. Lah. So here you label the vertical symptom here at the x equals to the negative 2. And you label the y as is and the x as is of the function here. And here the intercept here at the uh, negative 1. And you find the value of y. Uh, value of y. Uh, when x here equal to 0, so you find the value of y, yeah? 
Okay, and from the graph of the log function, you find the domain of the function. Uh, domain here start at the negative 2 to the positive uh, infinity. Okay, and the uh, range of the function, uh, all the real numbers negative to the positive uh, infinity. Okay, settle. Okay, question, uh, question 25, uh, this one uh, exercise. Okay, exercise. Uh, just show the step. Step one here, you find the vertical symptom. Uh, step two, you find the x intercepts of the function. And the last year, uh, you sketch the graph of the uh, loss function. And you find the domain, find the range of the function. Yeah? Okay, settle. Uh, shape of the log function. Uh, here, negative uh, log x plus 1, uh, base 3. Uh, so, shape here, you reflect on the uh, y-axis. Okay? Nanti, you punya shape nanti, dia akan terbalik. Eh? Yeah? Let me show your answer. Uh, yeah, this. Yeah? Uh, so, the vertical symptom here equals to the negative 1. And then, the intercepts here at the origin. Okay, and then you sketch the graph of the negative log x plus 1, uh, base 3. Okay, and uh, question uh, 26, uh, loan. Okay, uh, method. To sketch the graph of the log x and the ln x, uh, step one to step three. Yeah, uh, this one you check the vertical symptom here equal to the zero x intercept here at the one. Yeah, and here you check the base of the function. Uh, base uh, here uh, ln. Uh, Uh, you just compare the base of the loan function. Uh, loan here base equals to the e two point seven one eight, and the log function base here base ten. Yeah. Nanti semua nanti dia sama semua vertical asymptote uh, zero here, x intercept sama one. Cuma you punya shape saja. Kalau loan shape dia tinggi sikit. Yang lain tu sama saja. Yeah. Okay, uh, question 26. Uh, sketch the graph of the fx equals to the ln x minus 2 and find the domain, find the range of the function. Okay, uh, step 1, check. Okay, uh, question 26, uh, ln x minus 2. So first you find the vertical symptom of the ln function. Uh, x minus 2 here equal to 0. So the vertical at the 2, positive 2. And you find the x intercepts of the function. Uh, y here equal to 0. And value of x here equals to 3. And as this at the 3, 0. And here the shape of the ln. Yeah. Okay, so you draw the vertical symptom. Uh, x here equals 2. Okay, show your answer. So here you label the vertical symptom here, x equals 2, positive 2. 
and here the y axis u labels and here the x axis of the function and here intercept here at the three here and from the graph of the uh, lawn you find the domain of the function uh, domain here uh, two to the positive uh, infinity okay and the range of the function is uh, all the real numbers uh, negative infinity to the positive uh, infinity okay settle yeah okay question 27 here your exercise Uh, you sketch the graph of the fx equals to the ln x plus 4. Uh, step 1, you find the vertical asymptote. Uh, step 2, you find the x-intercept of the function. And then uh, last, you sketch the graph of the ln x and find the domain, find the range of the function. Yeah. Question 27, exercise. And then uh, question 20. 28 year exercise. Okay, question 28. Uh, you just reflex the negative uh, lon x. You reflex on the y axis. Yeah, uh, vertical asymptote here at the zero and the x in the separate function here equals to the one. Yeah. Okay, that's all for the LUA. Thank you.